Jerry, you know, many college kids, they're spending their Christmas break enjoying time with their friends and their family. But you know what? Not Devon. He's working out hard every day at a training facility in Pasadena. You could say he's a, a man on a mission to make his childhood dream become a reality. It was tough, you know, because um, I had uncles involved and a lot of stuff that was going on in the street. Devon Ross has seen a lot in his young life growing up in South L.A., surrounded by gangs, drugs, and relatives who were career criminals. My uncle was in and out of jail. He, he was a uh, crip. So, you know, like, 5 o'clock in the morning, they'll raid our houses um, looking for him. He was raised by a single mother in a three-bedroom apartment with nine other siblings. And so, football in school became his focus. I knew... If I wanted to play football, I had to do good in school. That was the main thing. After graduating from high school, UCLA came calling to come play for them. But Devon was faced with a big disappointment. He ended up being ineligible because he lacked some classes. So I go to a junior college. I went to L.A. Southwest College, and I um, did good there. And then I, um, I committed to another D Division One school, signed with another Division One school, named the University of Virginia. But all his classes couldn't be transferred, so Devon was faced with another setback. After that, I only had two weeks to try to find a school to uh, play football at, or you know, it was no more football. Devon launched a search all on his own. He ended up successfully playing wide receiver for the past two years at Central State in Ohio. Now he's pushing himself to reach his ultimate goal. Um, I told myself when I was young that I always wanted to go to the NFL. I always told, told my mom, like, I want to play in the NFL, and I'm in a position to do that. He says his mom is his number one fan, and, of course, we're all going to be rooting for Devon and watching him come mid-March. That's when he's going to be attending the NFL tryouts in Chicago. Best of luck to you. For now, reporting live in the newsroom, Mary Beth McDade. Cheryl, send it back to you in the studio.